The BVS-10 is a Swedish vehicle development by BAE Systems Land Systems Haglungs originally for the British Royal Marine Service, where it went on to be known as the Viking. Unique qualities of the light-armored military solution include an articulated center section for maximum flexibility and wide tracks for excellent cross-country mobility over soft terrain. The 5.5-ton, short, vehicle carries a Cummins 6.7L six-cylinder turbocharged diesel engine as its power pack, and a crew of four in the front-drive vehicle with seating for eight in the rear hull section. With its inbuilt troop-carrying capability, the vehicle is primarily intended as an armored personnel carrier APC, though other more specialized variants exist. It is typically modestly armed, mainly for self-defense purposes, through various machine gun, up to 12.7 mm. Fits or 40mm automatic grenade launchers AGLs. Armor protection is considered light to medium in the vehicle's base form, developed more so to counter the threat of small arms fire and artillery spray in contested zones than anything else. The protection level can, however, be enhanced through add-on armor panels. In addition to weaponry, the vehicle has onboard smoke grenade discharges for self-screening its movements, these being featured in two banks of four launchers at the front corners of the hull frame. The Cummins power pack is mated to an Allison automatic transmission system with six forward and one reverse speeds. Road speeds reach up to 70 kmh and operational ranges are limited to 500 km on internal fuel. Dimensions of the drive vehicle include a running length of 26.2 feet with a beam of 7.4 feet, and a height of 8 feet, when compared to earlier Haglund's articulated designs. This makes the BVS-10 dimensionally larger and able to carry more over longer distances. All told, the base design is relatively compact when compared to modern APC offerings. There are twin bullet-resistant windows at the front and additional panels along the sides with access possible through rectangular. Hinged access doors, also found along the sides of the hull. The engine sits in the bow in typical automobile fashion. The track and wheel arrangement has six small road wheels to a hull side with the track link run sporting broad surface pads for excellent ground contact. An access hatch at the hull roof provides another entry exit point for the crew as well as a mounting position for armament. The vehicle saw a relatively short development period spanning 2001 to 2004 and first deliveries to the Royal Marines were in 2005 resulting in a procurement of some 108 total hulls for the service. Since then, this unique search battlefield solution has been taken into operational service with the forces of Austria, France, Germany, ordered, Netherlands, Sweden, the United Kingdom, and the United States, ordered. More recently, it has been shipped to Ukraine to support the defensive war effort against Russian invaders. Canada is actively working to procure a stock of 100 of the Go Anywhere vehicles.